What's up guys, it's me Norlobomber and uh, today I have some very special news for you guys. Uh, heads up, I know my voice sounds a little weird, uh, my day just started so <laughs> I haven't really been talking too much today. But um, we have some important news uh, regarding Square Enix and uh, E3. So as we all know, uh, E3 was confirmed to be happening this year. It's all going to be happening uh, digitally, they're all just going to do basically like a, a video presentation online for everyone to see instead of actually posting everything at uh, the Los Angeles Convention Center. Um, so Square Enix has recently announced that they will be at E3 this year and not only that but um, they plan to announce uh, several games according to the uh, CEO uh, Matsuda he stated that in addition to upcoming games such as Near Replicant and Final Fantasy VII Re Integrate, uh, Square Enix has plans to also announce games one after the other at E3 this year. Um, so this is actually like really exciting because um, Square Enix, when they say that they're going to have these big conferences or have these big presentations, people can typically guess what's going to be there and typically they're right. And what does this mean for Kingdom Hearts? Well, Kingdom Hearts does have a very big chance of showing up. Just because we haven't seen anything from Kingdom Hearts in a while, um, they did sort of take a break from Kingdom Hearts. The Kingdom Hearts team, Nomura, said that they were taking a break. So there is a chance that they'll be there, but then again, there's a chance that they won't, simply because we know that Nomura has admitted that uh, he and the uh, Kingdom Hearts teams are kind of relaxing right now because they certainly did deliver with a big year in 2020. So they did have, they did earn a well-deserved rest. Um, but that's not to say that it won't show up and not to mention we do have the possibility of seeing other games such as Final Fantasy 16. Um, we could maybe see other stuff, maybe like a new Tomb Raider game. I really want to see a new Tomb Raider game. Um, but that's pretty much um, it. Uh, the rest is basically just going to be talking about what has the possibility of showing up. Now, um, Square Enix could announce two different Kingdom Hearts games, with one having a full-blown trailer and the other just maybe getting like a brief announcement. Um, we could see possibly a Varum Rex trailer. We could see something like a Kingdom Hearts Reconnect game. I'm still hoping that that game comes out. Um, but other than that, that's pretty much all I have to say. Um, I will leave a link to everything in the description below. Uh, I want you guys to uh, check it out. Hope you guys rate, comment, and subscribe. Check out my Twitter and my Twitch and my Discord. This has been Noir Lobomber, and I'm out.